Welcome back everyone. As most of you guys may know, on the Xbox app we now have some capability of streaming over our Xbox to our iPhones but also our iPads which is really awesome. So I'll go ahead and break down the process of doing so. You will need an Xbox in order to do this so keep that in mind you need some sort of Xbox One or even an Xbox Series S or X whenever those come out officially so you can go use those and it's the same exact process. So what you want to do is first of all you want to make your way over to your Xbox, the actual console. You want to go into the settings app and you want to go into devices and connections. You want to click on remote features and at the very bottom there's this little thing that says enable remote features you want to make sure you go ahead and click that that is a very important thing and if you don't enable this the rest of the process will not work so make sure you go ahead and enable that now what you want to do now is go make your way to your iPad and you want to download the Xbox app now you can download this by going straight into the App Store just typing in Xbox and whatever app looks just like this one you can go and use it now I will also link it down in the description so you can just download it from there so it should take a couple of seconds for it to download once you have it downloaded you want to go ahead and open it and you want to sign into the same credentials as your Xbox that you just you know went on and you went to the settings app and all that stuff you want to go and log into the same credentials aka the same gamer tag and all that stuff now if you don't have it then obviously you're going to have to figure out that out I don't know how to help you with that but most of you will probably already have that memorized it's probably the same email you've been using now once you're there you'll pretty much come into the app itself and you'll see that it says whatever it says it changes every so often I filmed this video a while ago and you want to go ahead and click on the top right there's a little Xbox that has like Wi-Fi signals coming out of it and you want to go ahead and select the remote play option. So the remote play option should be there somewhere at the very bottom or you can click on any other option too if you want to just do and play some installed games or something and you can pretty much just go there and figure it out so what you want to do now is you just have to wait for the xbox to eventually come up on the screen you will have to have your xbox you know at least plugged in and you can actually go anywhere you want to and actually do this apparently i haven't tried it yet but i will be probably trying it soon and i'll let you guys know how it is maybe i'll show you on twitter or something but that's really pretty much the process your xbox will eventually come up on the screen now do keep in mind that this software is still pretty early on and I've had a lot of issues on my iPhones and iPads. I haven't really had any issues on my Android device though because it's been on there longer so once you give it a couple more months I'm sure Xbox and Microsoft will figure it out further. Now at this point you can also connect a Bluetooth controller, a PS4 controller, Xbox controller straight to your iPad and, and pretty much just use your iPad as a display for your Xbox even when you're not around it which is really cool. As long as you're connected to a Wi-Fi signal and your Xbox is connected to a Wi-Fi signal in theory this should work so that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count, so it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well, my Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.